majesty Worship His majesty Unto Jesus be all glory, power West. 
this similar shuttle that you, 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 you experience. Because we deal with it, you all know that there is God. So we start right away from the known God to the unknown Jesus. It is not just as hard as your task. <laughs> I remember when I was saved in Kibli, there was a Scotchman. I still know his name, you know, that was way back in 1929. His name was Mr. Weir. W E I R. <laughs> he was a Scotchman. He didn't believe in the existence of God. When I tried to testify, he was very poor. But after I was, I was saved, he was uh, just a next door neighbor to the company for which I work. And he thought I was a fool. There is no God. I said, Who made me? He said, My father made me. <laughs> so that was my first experience. When, when I went overseas, I found that it a, a great deal of trouble, in, especially in England. From all other countries, you meet it in many countries, but it has been well known in England where people are highly sophisticated. It's a blessing to live with Englishmen. If you want to learn, uh, be a, an educated man and uh, know something, you go to England. It's an old country and they have everything uh, to know. The very first man who brought Christianity into India in about the fourth or fifth century, <coughs> you know that these people are old. They were not born yesterday. <laughs> I 